so we just found our spot. Um, it's like right on uh, a lake, which is super cool. So we're gonna explore it here in a minute. I got the truck set up. It's on uh, one of my traction boards to keep it level. And we'll do a setup of the tent and everything here after we explore our campsite. Yeah, this isn't gonna be a bad spot to spend the night. This spot's incredible. What do you think? Yeah, this is awesome. This is amazing. So beautiful. All you can hear is birds. All right, let's go get camp set up. Hey, and lunch. And lunch, I'm starving. Side over there. This is our setup. We still haven't set up the inside of the tent yet. We've got to get a fire going right here. Got to get the hammock up. Got to get the hammock up. You right. All right, so I made these little fire starters. Um, a while back. They're pretty cool. Um, they're just egg cartons and you take some dryer lint, shove it in there, melt some wax and pour it over the top. So they stay lit for a while and they burn slowly. You just place them in the kindling. I have um, newspaper because I like to light the newspaper and as that travels in it'll light the kindling but it should light those starters as well. So if the kindling struggles to catch, those fire starters will stay lit for a while. So it's pretty cool little things. And they're cheap, as in free. Melanie. <laughs> <laughs> you like our hammock? I thought you ordered a hammock. This feels more like a cocoon. Uh, that's what I... <laughs> <laughs> It's pretty dope though. I mean, it's comfy. What a spot. <laughs> I can't see the view though. You're doing a really good job at blocking the air for the fire. <laughs> it's like you're just a. It looks like it's giving birth to you. <laughs> That's what I feel like. <laughs> All right, so this is our campsite for the night. Um, it's not as. Uh, off the beaten path is as I was kind of hoping we were gonna be tonight but it's a pretty sweet spot um, we were trying to get up to Lake Gallagher but there's a lot of sl snow melt and that's degraded the road um, like a lot we talked to some guys who tried to get up there last night and they weren't able to get up there <clears throat> so and they were in a third gen Tacoma and a um, and a Jeep the new one whatever that is I don't know all the codes for Jeeps but uh, so this is where we at. It's a it's a sweet spot. I'll show you. Let's got our fire going. Got our hammock up. Our rooftop tent. That's where the cooking and stuff is gonna happen. And then this is one of our views, which is incredible. And then through the trees this way. There's a path that runs right down there <clears throat> through a creek and that has an amazing view of the lake. So this is our spot. We're gonna get um, the tent set up um, with like all the sleeping bag and stuff and then we're, I think we're pretty much just ready to hang out at that point. Mm -hmm. Excited. 
All right, so we're in the process of making dinner right now. Uh, we're gonna make chili dogs. <laughs> what did you do? The wind. <laughs> Just flew that. No. <laughs> Perfect. I told you this one's mine. Nice little topping. <laughs> so Melanie's responsible for the dogs, and clearly it's going well. And then over here, I got got the chili going. Um, yeah, it's gonna be good. The most appetizing part. <laughs> And he's dishing us up now. That one's yours. Okay. This one's mine. <laughs> Seems to be a difference there. <laughs> so we're sitting by the fire and Melanie correctly observed that I did not have a drink, but I needed one. So I brought stuff to make uh, an old fashioned, which is uh, my absolute favorite. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> set up our bed for the night. So I wanted to show you guys before it gets dark. So we got um, underneath the comforter we have, so we have the mattress that um, that the Tapui comes with. We have a um, double size sleeping bag and it's flannel. It's gonna be really nice. And we have a comforter on top of that. Should be plenty warm. This is the inside of the sleeping bag, so it's nice and nice and warm. This sleeping bag is good for about 40 degrees, which it's not gonna get there tonight. But Melanie is freezing all the time, so we did that. And then I have this little light that I hung up up here, so it's pretty cool. It's a good setup. All right, so I was responsible for finding uh, where we were coming this weekend and scoping all that out, packing all the camping stuff and stuff like that. Melanie was responsible for um, all the food. She wanted to do that. Um, she was super, super excited about it. So she's making us some dessert right now. So what I'm gonna attempt to make um, is, uh, it's like kind of like a pineapple upside down cake, but in like the little foil packets that a lot of times people do with camping. And so you can use either fresh or canned pineapple. Um, you use a um, store-bought, or I guess you could make it ahead at home if you'd like, um, pound cake. And then um, butter, brown sugar, and a little bit of cinnamon. And it's supposed to be really good, so I'm excited to try it. I'm really excited to try it. I eat dinner so I can have dessert, so expectations are high. <laughs>
Thank you. You're welcome. That you like it. so good. Oh yeah, that's so good. All right guys, so it's starting to get a little dark. I feel like the camera is gonna start struggling to pick stuff up, so we're gonna um, pick this back up in the morning. My favorite thing about camping is just waking up in the morning and hearing all the birds and there were frogs going all last night um, getting a cup of coffee ready and just sitting by the fire and relaxing it's really nice to just get away from from the city and life at home and and just relax. How'd you sleep, Melanie? I slept like a baby. <laughs> yeah. 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 You seem pretty. Pa Even when I woke up this morning, you were like, you didn't really move much at all. You were out. Yeah. Yeah. No, I was. I was comfortable, and when you after you got up, I fell back asleep. Yeah. It was also 5 a.m. But <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she. <clears throat> she tried to be nice to me this morning when I was getting up, but it didn't work very well. But I redeemed myself by bringing her coffee and then she put a smile on her face. She's like, oh, okay, thanks. <laughs> You're not wrong. <laughs> so it's, we're gonna enjoy the fire for a bit, but it's starting to rain again. Um, you guys can hear that it's super windy. So we'll hang out here for a bit, but we wanna do some um, kind of exploring around, around this area um, before we, before we head out, so. Uh, there's still oh, something. and breakfast. Yeah, I'm making breakfast. Here, you want two? Two? Oh yeah, I do a double. You do a double s'more? Yeah. I'll prep the, the grams. Oh, got a little, yeah. a little sizzle action. Cool. I mean, the, our dessert was delicious, but I still wanted s'mores. You could have had s'mores. Yeah, but it was raining and you're burning ah, already. No! Why? Every time. Ooh, look at that. Look at David's oh, version. Oh, that's better. My to leave your campsite as you found it so we're all cleaned up ready to go packing out what we packed in it was super clean when we got here so there wasn't any extra garbage or anything to pick up so um, yeah but pick up after yourself if you come out here and do this stuff because if you don't that's when trails start getting shut down and <clears throat> that's just not cool
As you guys can see, the weather is really not cooperating with us. Um, so we went up that one trail. Um, it was really rocky and it started raining and we knew um, we couldn't get much further because of the guys we talked to yesterday. So we decided to turn around um, and we're just gonna head out. So, um, but it was a really, really good first trip out with um, with this setup. I think we learned a lot and we have stuff that we wanna change, things that we wanna get to make things um, a little bit easier. Um, <clears throat> So it was a good, it was a good trip. I don't know how this video has turned out because this will be different for me to edit, but I hope you guys liked it. If you did, be sure to like it and comment and subscribe um, and do all that. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one.